Have you ever seen this type of message? Have you ever clicked to view? This message is warning about disturbing content. You may see images of violence, death, or physical harm. But you have a choice. Do you want to see it or you want to avoid it? If there is such a high chance of having a negative reaction or an upsetting feeling, why do we sometimes click? What about the people in that image? What about their story? My name is Anastasia Vivanco Carlevari, and my research is about the reasons why people decide to learn about strangers' suffering. Whether it is a war, a mass shooting, or the social consequences of climate change. Every day we get a chance to see or hear stories of people we don't even know. Scary stories, upsetting incidents. Why are we interested? Why do we want to know what happened? Research in social psychology has some answers, and there are different ways of understanding these questions. We know that negative events triggers people's curiosity. Also, while learning about someone's suffering, people feel empathy. But that's not always the case. In which cases do people empathize? What conditions are needed? In our studies, we have directly asked people to tell us what kind of situations of suffering they engage with and their reasons for doing so. What triggers them to look, to read or to listen? Some people do it because they want to understand their own experiences of suffering. Some people want to imagine how they would deal with such a situation. Some people want to have a better idea of the world we live in. Although stories of suffering can make us feel uncomfortable, learning about it can be useful. Stories of suffering and overcoming hardship can be inspirational or insightful they can help us develop our own personal values. I am interested in this topic because I believe that only when people know about the suffering of others, they can relate with it. Some situations of suffering are urgent, but if people don't engage with them, how is change even possible? I believe more research on this topic can help us promote a more empathetic society by raising awareness and understanding of social struggles. So next time you see that warning in social media and you need to decide to click or not, think about whether it might help you to acknowledge the story of that person suffering. Thank you for your attention. <laughs>